Yehoshua, Joshua chapter 15. And the lot of the tribe of the children of Yehuda, for their clans was to the border of Edom, the wilderness of Sin, southward in the extreme south. And their southern border began at the edge of the salt sea from the bay that faces southward. And it went out to the southern side of the ascent of Akrabim, passed over to Sin, and went up on the south side of Kadesh Barnea, and passed over to Hetzron, and went up to Adar, and went around to Karka, and passed over to Atzman, and went out to the wadi of Mitzrayim, and the border ended at the sea. This is your southern border. And the east border was the salt sea as far as the end of the Jordan, and the border on the northern quarter began at the bay of the sea at the end of the Jordan. And the border went up to Beth Hogla, and passed over north of Beth Araba. And the border went up to the stone of Bohan, son of Reuben. And the border went up toward Debir from the valley of Achor, and it turned northward toward Gilgal, which is before the ascent of Adumim, which is south of the wadi. And the border passed over the waters of En Shemesh and ended at Enrogel. And the border went up by the valley of the sign of Hinnom to the southern slope of the Yebusite city, that is, Yerushalayim. And the border went up to the top of the mountain that lies before the valley of Hinnom westward, which was at the end of the valley of Rephaim northward. And the border went around from the top of the hill to the fountain of the water of Neftova, and went up to the cities of Mount Ephron. And the border went around to Baal Allah, that is, Kiryath Yearim. And the border turned around from Bay Alal toward uh, westward to Mount Seir, and passed over to the side of Mount Yearim on the north, that is, Kesalon, and went down to Beth Shemesh, and passed over to Timna. And the border went out to the side of Ekron northward. And the border went around to Shikaron, and passed over to Mount Baalah, and went out to Yebnael, and the border ended at the sea. And the west border was the coastline of the great sea. This is the boundary of the children of Yehuda, all around for their clans. And to Caleb, son of Yefuna, he gave a portion in the midst of the children of Yehuda, according to the mouth of Yah to Yehoshua. Kiriath Arba, that is Hebron, Arba was the Arba was the father of Anak, and Caleb drove out the three sons of Anak from there, Shishai, and Achiman, and Talmai, the children of Anak. And he went up from there to the inhabitants of Debir, and the name of Debir formerly was Kiriath Sefer. And Caleb said, He who strikes Kiriath Sefer and shall capture it, to him I shall give Aksa, my daughter, as a wife. And Othniel, son of Kenaz, the brother of Caleb, did capture it, so he gave him Aksa, his daughter, as wife. And it came to be when she came to him that she persuaded him to ask her father for a field. And when she got off from, her don from the donkey, Caleb said to her, What is the matter? And she said, Give me a blessing, since you have given me land in the south. Give me also fountains of water. And he gave her the upper fountains and the lower fountains, this is the inheritance of the tribe of the children of Yehuda for their clans. And the cities at the furthest border of the tribe of the children of Yehuda, toward the border of Edom in the south, were Kabzael and Eder and Yagur and Kena and Demona and Adada and Kadesh and Hatzor and Yithnan, Ziv and Talem and Baaloth and Hatzor, Hadata and Kiriath, Hetron, that is Hatzor, Amam, and Shema, and Malada, and Hatzar Gada, and Heshman, and Beth Palet, and Hatzar Shual, and Be'er Sheba, and Bishothya, Be'Allah, and Iyim, and Etzem, and El Toda, and Kesil, and Horma, and Siklag, and Mad Madmana, and Sansana, and Lebaoth, and Shilchim, and Ayin, and Raman. All the cities were twenty-nine with their villages. In the low country, 
Eshtaol, and Sora, and Ashna, and Zanova, and Inganim, Tapuva, and Enam, Yarmuth, and Adulam, Soko, and Aseka, and Sha'arayim, and Adithaim, and Gadera, and Gederothaim, fourteen cities with their villages, Senan, and Hadasha, and Migdogad, and Dilan, and Mitzpeh, and Yothetel, Yoth, Lakish, and Botskath, and Eglon, and Kavan, and Lamam, and Kitlish, and Gederoth, and Beth Dagon, and Naama, and Makeda, sixteen cities with their villages. Libna, and Ether, Ashan, and Yifta, and Ashna, and Nitzib, and Keila, and Akzib, and Marisha, nine cities with their villages, Ekron with its towns and its villages, from Ekron to the sea, all that were by the side of Ashdod with their villages, Ashdod, its towns and its villages, Aza, its towns and its villages, as far as the Wadi of Mitzrayim and the Great Sea with its coastline. And in the mountain country, Shamur, and Yatir, and Soko, and Dana, and Kiryasana, that is Debir, and Anab, and Eshtimo, and Anim, and Goshen, and Halon, and Gilo, seven cities with their villages, Arab, and Duma, and Eshan, and Yanim, and Beit Tepuva, and Afika, and Chutma, and Kiryath Arba, that is Hebron, and Seor, nine cities with their villages, Maon, Carmel, and Ziv, and Yuta, and Yisrael, and Yokdemam, and Zanova, Cain, Giba, Tim, Timna, ten cities with their villages, Hauhul, Beasur, and Gedor, and Ma'arath, and Beth Anoth, and El Tekon, six cities with their villages, Kiryath Baal, that is Kiryath Yearim, and Rabbah, two cities with their villages, in the wilderness, Beth Araba, Medin, and Sekaka, and Nebshan, and the city of Salt, and Engedi, six cities with their villages. As for the Yebusites, the inhabitants of Yerushalayim, the children of Yehuda were unable to drive them out. So the Yebusites have dwelt with the children of Yehuda at Yerushalayim to this day.